fucking welcome. Today's workout is my TRX cardio circuit workout. Now, we are also going to perform this ladder style, baby cakes. So what does that mean? That means we are gonna ladder the time down with every set. So it's gonna be awesome. Get your TRX set up, let's go start sweating. Now, before we get busy, I want to make sure that you know how to adjust your TRX quickly because we do need it fully lengthened as well as mid-length in this workout. So mid-length on these TRXs is where the gray and the black meet. You might have a TRX with two double yellow lines. So that's mid-length and that's what we're going to use for most of the moves. However, for our chest press move, and then we're just going to keep it lengthened for the moves following thereafter, we need it fully lengthened. So place your hands behind the metal counts. That would, that's what locks the TRX in place. Take your thumb and pull the cam down just halfway. Now fully lengthen at the same time. Yeah! See, you don't want to fully lengthen one at a time. No. All right, that's what newbies do. You're not a newbie. And then one at a time to get back to mid length. All right, it's that simple. Okay, we have eight moves on the round. We have 50 seconds we're starting out with and then we ladder down all the way to 20 seconds. Mixture of strength with a cardio move to keep that heart rate up. I'm gonna do my best to turn and face you. Otherwise, it's really just gonna be my shoulder, but we're at a challenging angle to try and film the TRX here in the studio. So let's get ourselves warmed up with a row. Palms facing each other, chest lifted, bum up, and drive the hips and bring the elbows past the rib cage. Beautiful. So you want about 60% of your body weight here. You want this to be you know, not too challenging. We're warming up. Getting into the back, into the arm muscles. Now you want to do a plank here and then keep that plank. Your body's lined up with the TRX anchor. When we straighten the arms, we keep those shoulders pulled back and down. Last four. Three, two, one. Walk yourself back so you're standing upright, but your shoulders or elbows are under the shoulders. Feet apart, toes turned out, drop down for a squat as deep as you can, then drive the hips and come up again. Once you've seen me, I want your eyes up, looking at the anchor so the neck is in alignment. Squeeze the booty on that up face for me, okay? Don't let that butt just go along for the ride. Make it work. Now the TRX is here for some support, so that's kind of nice, but not 100% support. <laughs> we want the legs working. <laughs> 20 more seconds. Last two. And elbows under shoulders, left knee up, step back into a lunge, do it again. Try to balance on the right leg only. Back knee coming straight down to the floor while we keep the upper body zipped up. Continuing with our warm up, some dynamic mobility here for this left hip. Last three. Other leg. Beautiful, here we go. Heart rate should be getting up there a bit right now too. Or is it just me? <laughs> Last three. And release, shake it out. All right, grab a quick sip of water because we are gonna get started on that workout. Okay, so it's eight exercises. The first four were at mid length, okay? The last four were at fully lengthened. We start with a strength and then we alternate that with a high energy drill. 50 seconds are on the clock, so this first round's probably gonna be the toughest. Well, probably it will be. Okay, palms facing up for me. Walk yourself in, give me that plank, and we're driving the elbows past the rib cage, working in the back, and then putting some emphasis on those biceps. You ready? Well, get yourself ready. We gotta get going. Can't wait all day. All right, here we go. Palm up, ready, go. Now make sure you're lined up with your anchor points, wherever that may be, or where you have your TRX hanging, okay? 
and then chase that plank, baby cakes. Now as we ladder down in time, we might be able to get a little closer to our wall or our target on this exercise. Remember, the closer you are to your TRX anchor point, the more challenging the move it becomes. So we can play around with it as we ladder down in time. Woo, 50 seconds is a long time, isn't it? <laughs> Dime. All right. Taking it into a skater. So I want you to come off to the side for me. Hopefully you've got some room in your place for your TRX is. We skate across into a bit of a crossover lunge. Another side. Let's try it. Cross. So a skater, crossover lunge. Now do you really need the TRX to do this move? No. <laughs> so you can let go of it if you want but this is a TRX workout, so I had to incorporate it. <laughs> Working into the hips here. Woo! Glutes, thighs, getting that heart rate up, I hope. Man, I feel like I have a piano tied to my ass today. <laughs> my apologies if I'm not moving as fast as you. <laughs> Something going on to me today. It's okay. As long as we show up, right? Time. As long as you show up and do your best. That's all we can ask. Okay, V lift. So now we're eliminating the arms. On the lift, moving just into the mid back. Okay, and upper back. Give it a try. Now as you lift up, shoulder blades drive into your back pocket and back to straight arms. It's a really nice posture exercise, but please, as I said, try not to move through the elbows. It's shoulders. We have a jumping jack drill with the TRX after this. a good little back burn. Holy cow. And hopefully that heart rate's still staying up there, okay? We need that heart rate up. Done. Woo. All right, elbows under shoulders, feet together. We go into a jack like so. If you don't like the high impact, you tap it side to side. Okay, always options. Don't worry about it. Feet together, hands down, chest lifted, go. Now, you're going to feel this in your shoulders and back because we just trained them and now they're working again. So if it gets too much, get rid of your TRX. Now after this move at home, we need to fully lengthen. Remember what I taught you for warm up, both handles at the same time? Awesome. Land soft. Arms just going to shoulder height. Stay lined up with that anchor. Time. Woo! All right, fully lengthened for me. See? You look like a pro when you do both at the same time. Get set up your chest press. Feet are apart if you're newer to the TRX. Knuckles are pointed down to your ground, straps are off of the upper arm. They may touch your forearms. Lower down, press forward. Wrists stay straight. If the straps are really rubbing on your arms, I want you to lift your arms up a little bit away from your body. Now your bum is in. So what I quite often see is this. All right, the bum's in a different postal code. Uh-uh, not you. So step away from the wall and get the form first. All right, make it super easy so you can nail that form and then walk closer to your anchor to make it more challenging. Now this is a great sub for push-ups. So if you have a TRX and if we're doing push-ups in other workouts and you're like, screw it PJ, I hate push-ups, get the TRX, fully lengthen it and get the same thing with the TRX. 
done. All right, so we've got some knee drive. So let's bring the T-Rex on the inside of the body and then right up to the armpits and then walk ourselves into a 45 degree angle. Right leg in front. You with me? Beautiful. Now take that left knee and drive it up. Do it again. Now add a hop if you can. You got it. 50 seconds here. Woo! You are going to feel that right leg. Yes? Good. Glad I'm not the only one. Now we'll keep the straps fully lengthened for our next move. Typically we would go mid length, but you know what? It's not going to really affect the move. Sorry TRX if you're watching. <laughs> Done. All right, so if you want to go back to mid length, you can. Working just the triceps as well as into the core. Arms up, lean into your straps. Thumb is in. Bend the elbows, bring the hands right beside each ear and then press forward. Beautiful. Again, get away from your anchor so that it's easy. You can get the form and then walk yourself towards your anchor to get the intensity. I see this done incorrectly quite a bit, so really pay attention to your form. Because once you get it, oh my goodness at home, this is going to hands down be your favorite tricep exercise in the entire universe. Trainers promise. After this is done, we have the other side knee drive, okay? So, right knee will drive. Woo! Tricep burning. Keep that plank though, don't let that bum push back. Let it drop with you so my heels kind of lift up time as I go down. All right, straps on the inside of the body. Hands at the armpits, walk into my 45. Left leg forward now. Right knee drive, 50 seconds, go. So, we will drop the time after this move to 40 seconds. So tell your legs that, tell your heart rate that. So keep it clean all the way to the end. Come on, let's go. Oh yeah, left leg burning. Oh boy, <laughs> my leg is dying on me. Die. All right, well I set the timer up to 40 seconds. TRX at mid length for me, and then by all means grab some water, but keep moving those feet. Don't move, don't stop moving. Whew. I'm gonna grab a sip. Low row, palms up, so our bicep um, focused row pattern coming up. Okay, so 40 seconds. A little less time. Maybe we can go a little closer to the wall. Give it a try. Here we go. Palms up. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Skaters coming up. All right, skaters. So don't forget that crossover lunge on each end of your skater. Come a little off to the side of your anchor. Skate, good. So how far you skate, you can add the jump or you can just step wide to make it a low impact move. Your workout, baby cakes, your choice.
V lifts coming up. Lifting up into the V, slide the shoulders into your back pocket. Let's go. Feet apart so we keep the hips still. A little further away from your anchor than we did with that first back drill. Okay? Feel the mid back, feel the shoulder blades sliding down. Woo. Jumping jacks, high or low impact coming up. Time. All right, standing upright, elbows under shoulders, palms together, feet together. Remember you have that option, jump or no jump, okay? You choose what's gonna work for you today. Ready, set, go. Land soft if you're doing the high impact. I mean that with love. <laughs> Dime. <laughs> I do. 
All right, walk away from the wall, handles under your armpits. Now walk forward in a 45, okay? Right leg forward. Nope, left leg forward. <laughs> Ready? Right knee drive, go. going down to 30 seconds now. We're on our final two rounds. Palms up, pull up. Yes, yes. Ready? Good for you. Let's go. Walk yourself into a 45. Whew. 
Right leg is forward. Left knee drives with or without the hop. Go. So don't try to just launch yourself forward. It's about an up phase as well. Triceps coming up. Time. Woo. Again, you can go mid length to your T-Rex if you'd like on this. Arms up. It's about forehead with the hands or slightly above. And go. seconds. TRX is at mid length. Oh yeah. All right. Quick sip. Okay. Palms up. Maybe a bit closer. Yeah. Okay. It's 20 seconds. Okay. Fewer reps. Let's see if we can make it more strength based now. Ready? Go.
Time. Handles in. On an angle. Left foot forward. Right knee drive. Ready, set, and go. Triceps. Couldn't need my bangs trimmed. Oh, just thought I'd share. Here we go. Bend the elbows, hands towards the ears, go. So give me a full range of motion here at home. Straighten the arms completely and really drop those hands down towards your shoulders, towards the ears. TRX if you'd like for some support. Heel to the bum, start with a quad stretch, knee pointed down, squeeze the bum forward. Ha! Ah, yes. Work out the kinks in those quads. So listen, obviously you own a TRX if you did this workout with me. So awesome. Good for you. Again, like I said, most favorite piece of equipment. Now I have a ton of other workouts on the channel, so make sure you head there afterwards. Subscribe to the channel too and click that notification bell. That way I can let you know every time I drop a new workout. Release. Woo. Release. Grab the handles. Press your palms into the handles, feet hip width apart, softness in the knees, extend the body forward, arms extended, flex the spine, and push the tailbone up. Feel that stretch in the hamstrings. Come on up, round the back now, separate the shoulder blades, feel the stretch there. Release. Woo. Bring the handles on top. Cross the, sorry, inside leg over outside. Push the hip away. Stretch the lateral line of the body. Now when we do the other side, I'm going to have my back turned to you. My apologies. I know it's rude. But what can you do when your camera's on a tripod? All right, other side. Inside leg crosses over. Push the hip away. Release, handles behind you, arms up, stagger once to foot in front, open up the chest, gaze is up, handles up, feel that stretch across the arms and chest. Bring the other leg forward, bring the arms on top now, let your body go through. And release. You did it! Hey, thanks so much for joining me. Now don't forget, subscribe, click that notification bell, and then hey, why don't you drop a comment? Let me know where you're working out from down below. Have a great rest of your day. Bye. All right, thanks for joining me. High five.